right, so there is the parts inventory. See, that is a long list of stuff. Two sides. Haven't gone through to actually verify it's all in there, but there's definitely a lot of pieces. Gears and bearings. Mounts and screws. Something I hope they didn't just break. Yeah, lots and lots of parts in here. Um, supposed to be, I believe, everything that you need to convert it over to the portal axle kit from the stock uh, in stock axles. So there it is. Bag sliced, ready to get to working. we find more bags in the bags there's the front right and front left and now all the bags in a bag are sliced This one didn't want to come out. Cow RC mat comes in handy when you're dumping stuff. <laughs> Doesn't keep everything in place, but it definitely helps. So there's the front right or front left side. I can't remember what uh, bag one was, right or left, but there they are. So I'm making my way through the front axle kit and it looks like on the CVs they didn't include these grub screws so I've got a couple here not too big of a deal but uh, if you're getting the portal kit before release one of the beta testers um, yeah check that out make sure you have a couple extra grub screws because I do not see any in the kit Maybe they're in the wrong bag. I haven't opened up all the bags yet, but uh, so far, um, that's all I've seen missing. But uh, we'll keep on chugging along and see what else is there is. All right, so uh, I've gotten a little bit of the ways into building the kit, um, the portal axle kit now, and initial impressions. I would say it's you know it looks pretty decent quality. Um, I was missing the grub screws for each of the CVs on the front. Uh, not too big of a deal because I had some, but uh, if you don't keep a bunch of grub screws around, something to look out for if you're getting one of the early kits here. Um, I'll you know, make sure I message Red Cat about that so they know um, they're missing from there and can fix that before they come out. But um, yeah, everything else, you know, the plastic seems decent quality, metal seems decent quality. It's, it's you know, Red Cat stuff, um, which I haven't, you know, had any more problems with the Red Cat stuff than I have with the uh, Axial or Traxxas stuff so far. So uh, maybe I've had good luck. Maybe the whole Red Cat sucks thing isn't quite as true as it used to be <laughs> or ever was. I don't know. Um, so anyways, I'm going to keep building it. Look for an update here in the next couple of days. Um, i got to get the axles off the other Gen 7, get that one stripped down so I can put the portals on, and then I'll take it out for a spin hopefully this weekend. So... Thanks for watching and look for an update and some more thoughts on the portals coming here soon.